There are some places on Earth that everyone really should have seen, and some places that everyone has already seen. But what about the ones that you don't hear much about? They might not be totally unknown, but these seven underrated travel destinations are definitely worth a visit. Hello again, Love Beyond Nations here. If you like our content, consider subscribing and share it with your travel partner. Without any further ado, let's hop on to our list. Number 1. Petra, Jordan We would lie by claiming Jordan has no tourists, though it deserves definitely more attention. Due to its proximity to unstable countries, many people avoid this region. Nonetheless, the country is totally safe to travel and the kindness of the locals is just heartwarming. Walking the steps of the Bedouins in Wadi Rum by having an overnight trip in the desert or discover old Christian sites. Jordan's most famous attraction is the ancient city of stone, Petra. You can marvel the architecture of this UNESCO World Heritage Site and learn more about old traditions. A must, if you're in Petra, is the two-hour hike to the treasury. We do not recommend riding a donkey, a camel or any other animal to take you the way up. These poor animals are very often mistreated and sometimes have to carry double of their own weight. Number 2. Valencia in Spain While traveling to Spain, most people decide to visit Barcelona or Madrid. Nevertheless, the city of Valencia is a true gem at the southeast coast of the country. Valencia is a master of combining its rich history with modern architecture. In no other city in Europe, the contrast of old and new is that distinct. One of its most famous attractions is the City of Arts and Science, a combination of buildings containing museums, events and an aquarium. Only a short walk away, the old town of Valencia catches you with its charm and invites you to explore the city inside the ancient walls. Furthermore, Valencia has a beautiful beach area with a lot of cool bars perfect for young people. The best way to get around is by taking the subway. It is cheap, reliable and safe. Number 3. Raja Ampat, Indonesia We totally understand why Raja Ampat is still unknown to most of you, even though it is one of the most beautiful sceneries on Earth. To get there, you first need to fly into Indonesia then take another flight to Sarong in West Papua and from there you have to take the ferry to one of the islands of your choice. After a seamlessly never-ending travel, you will get reported with crystal clear water and a lot of local children smiling at you. Perfect for snorkeling and diving, but also for connecting with locals, this place is a dream destination for those wanting to avoid mass tourism. Also, if there is not much to do on the islands themselves, this trip is made for disconnecting with the daily stress from the Western life. Number 4. Sicily, Italy Italy is not known for too few tourists, but still has some gems to offer. The island in the south of Italy has the perfect balance between tourism and traditional Italian culture. The 25 square kilometer island is a paradise for riding a bike or all kinds of water sport activities. After a fun time at the beach, head to the nearest town and experience the authentic Italian lifestyle. You can even wander at the trails of the Mafia or visit the Catacombs dei Cappuccini. If you're into hiking, you can even climb one of the few active volcanoes in Europe, Mount Etna. The most spectacular attractions are the beautiful Agadian Islands, a group of five islands off the northwest coast of Sicily. Getting around on the island is pretty easy. Just rent a Vespa and enjoy the ride. Number 5. Sarajevo, Bosnia With only around 600,000 visitors per year, Sarajevo truly is a hidden gem in Europe. The capital city of Bosnia and Herzegovina is a melting pot of cultures and religions, which makes it really worth visiting. Jewish synagogues, Orthodox cathedrals, Islamic mosques and Catholic churches represent the four religions of the city, all living peacefully together. Many memorials of World War II remind us of the country's sad history, although it is now one of the main tourist hotspots in the Balkans. Either if you like tasting Bosnian coffee and cevapcici, or buy some handcrafted souvenirs in the old alleys, there is something for everyone. 
take the cable car to reach the top of Mount Trebovich to have the spectacular view over the city. Most of the tourist attractions can be found within walking distance in the city center. Number 6. Osaka, Japan Most people only think of Tokyo when visiting Japan, but the country has so much more to offer. We think Tokyo's little sister, Osaka, is definitely an underrated destination and is the perfect starting point for some of the country's main tourist hotspots, such as Kyoto and Hiroshima. The city itself has a more local atmosphere and people tend to be even friendlier. It also has a nice mix of nightlife, culture and great food, while being cheaper as the capital Tokyo. The most iconic sites in Osaka are the Osaka Castle and the giant Ferris wheel. While exploring the city, you can get a feel of traditional Japanese lifestyle and taste authentic dishes. The perfect time to visit would be during Cherry Blossom to experience the picturesque landscapes and views. Number 7. Havana, Cuba After its decision to make the country more accessible for tourists, Cuba gained popularity quite fast. For now, it is still considered a hidden spot with a rather small amount of visitors. Havana, the capital everyone must have seen, is a cool spot for nightlife. Smoking Cuban cigars, listening to live music or taking some salsa dance lessons. A lot of fun is expecting you. Although, there is Trinidad, a smaller town in the south of the country, giving you a more genuine insight to the Cuban lifestyle. Typical for the country are the vibrant colors of the houses and cars. Get off the beaten path to explore the beautiful countryside or relax at one of the many white sand beaches. Cuba offers a wide variety of attractions for every kind of visitor. If you consider going on a round trip, you can easily rent a car or take some domestic flights to save time, as the island is rather large. Hi guys, thanks for watching our new video. We hope it gives you some inspiration to find your next travel destination. For more travel videos, just check out our channel. If you like our content, please subscribe and be sure to give it a like down below. Have a great day and see you next time. Bye! Bye. <laughs>